Hello friends, welcome to Top Brain GK. So in this video, I'm going to tell you difference and similarities between Northern and Southern Hemisphere. Let's start. The equator separates the Earth into two hemisphere, Northern and Southern Hemisphere. Hemisphere means half of the Earth. The Northern Hemisphere is the Northern half of the Earth it starts at zero degree latitude means the equator and continue north to 90 degree north latitude on the north pole. The southern hemisphere is the southern half of the earth. It also starts at zero degree latitude and continues south to 90 degree south latitude on the south pole. The northern hemisphere is mostly land and contains most of the countries including Europe, Asia, North America, two-third of Africa, part of South America, and a small area of Australia. But in the other side, in the Southern Hemisphere, there are less countries, including most of Africa, most of South America, and the Australia. Now, let's talk about similarities. If you see similarities between these two hemispheres, then the major similarity is both hemisphere are separated by the equator. And the next is the earth rotate at speed of around 1040 miles per hour at the equator. The speed of the person at the equator is fast because it covers more distance in the same time. But the speed of a person at the North Pole and the South Pole is about zero because he has no distance to cover. Now let's talk about differences. Now focus the main difference between these two hemispheres. First one is land and water percentage. As you can see in this map, the northern hemisphere has more land as compared to the southern hemisphere. It has 60.7% land and 39.3% water. Just because of huge land along with water bodies, it plays a great impact on weather and climate pattern. On the other side, Southern Hemisphere has less land and has more water bodies. It has 80.9% of water and 19.1% of land. Second difference is human population. Because of the huge landmass of Northern Hemisphere, this is already clear that more humans live in the Northern Hemisphere when compared to the Southern Hemisphere. Around 90% of the total population live in the Northern Hemisphere while the rest live in the Southern part. Third difference is different seasons. Seasons in the Northern and Southern Hemisphere are totally opposite. When it is winter in the Northern Hemisphere, it is summer in the Southern Hemisphere. Summer in the Northern Hemisphere takes place between June to September, but in Southern Hemisphere, summers takes place between December to March. Summers in the Northern Hemisphere are a few days longer than summers in the Southern Hemisphere. Next, if we talk about shadow movement, as we know, the sun rises in the east and sets in the west, in both the northern and southern hemisphere. But if we are talking about shadow movement, there are differences here. In the northern hemisphere, shadows move clockwise. But in southern hemisphere, shadow moves anticlockwise. Next difference is moon position. We are all looking at the same moon, but the view of moon in this hemisphere are completely different. The moon appears to be upright in the northern hemisphere. It means the line separating the light up side and dark side of the moon moves from right to left during first quarter. And in this phase, the right half of the moon is light up. But in the southern hemisphere, the moon appears to be upside down, means the line separating the light up side 
and dark side of the moon moves from the left to right during first quarter and in this phase the left half of the moon is light up next difference it is very easy to view the galaxy from the northern hemisphere compared to the southern hemisphere it is much difficult to view the galaxy from the southern hemisphere as the stars are really less bright and it block the view four of the five world oceans are located in the northern hemisphere the pacific arctic indian and atlantic ocean the southern ocean is the only ocean that is located in the southern hemisphere except for the arctic ocean the other four ocean the pacific indian and atlantic ocean are also located in the southern part thank you so much for watching this video if you have any question about this video you can ask me thank you so much four of the five world oceans are located in the northern hemisphere the pacific arctic indian and atlantic ocean the southern ocean is the only ocean that is located in the southern hemisphere except for the arctic ocean the other four ocean the pacific indian and atlantic ocean are also located in the southern part thank you so much for watching this video if you have any question about this video you can ask me thank you so much